Hey guys, we're working on your vision board and I just wanted to make sure you guys understand how everything's supposed to go, okay? So when you go into the Google Classroom and you find, sorry the baby's having fun over there, <laughs> and you find the um, vision board assignment, there's going to be this Google slide attached, okay? So when you open it up, it's going to start off with my vision board and it says put your name and class board here. So you just click delete all of this and then put your name and class period okay um down at the bottom there's some instructions it says you can change the font and colors if you would like so if you're like i really don't like this up here triple click one two three highlights all of it then up here you can go to the font you can change that. Um, if you don't see some of the stuff you want, you can click on more. And it will let you change the color right here. Pick from any of the colors you want. You can also change your size if you want it bigger, smaller, whatever. Um, and you can do that to any of the stuff on here. Okay, so we're gonna move on to the next page. On the next page, things that are important in my future. Delete this text right here because this is just to set it up for you. So you're going to be listing a bunch of things that you see in your future. What do you want? Do you want to be in college? Do you want to already have a fancy job? What's the job you want? Do you want to be building a family? Do you want to have tons of money? Do you want to have, what do you want? Okay, so start listing all the different things that you see for your future in about 10 or 15 years right here. Then you're going to move on to the next page. This one is blank. This is the one you're going to start building your vision board on. Okay. So down here, there are the instructions. This page is for you to construct your digital vision board. Drag, drop, and edit images that you find online or that you take of things that reflect your vision for the future. Okay. So for example, I really want to be able to do glass art in the future more than I do now. So then I would see if I can drag and drop some pictures. Let me see if I can drag it. Yep, so I have a picture of some glass over here. I also want a picture of a kiln. Ooh, I want a bigger kiln. Large glass kiln. Yes, this will do. So I will see if I can drag and drop this beautiful kiln to my vision board. Perfect. And let me see if I can edit it any. Maybe I'll edit out some of the cord at the back. And then I'm just going to keep on adding images. So if I want to make lots of money while I'm doing my glass art, lots of money. I think I like that one. And of course, if I did this correctly, I would have already put all of this stuff over here so that I know what I'm doing. I'm not just coming up with it while I'm looking for images. Okay. And then the part where it says you can um, use images that you've taken. So if you take pictures and they're on your Chromebook, you can load those images as well. So once this is full, you're done with this part. Okay. So good luck. Have fun. See, can't wait to see what you guys make.